So today we're out here with the Marines of 1st Battalion, 2nd Marines. We're integrating into the, uh, the line companies to provide electronic warfare support down to the platoon level. The electronic warfare increases the lethality of the Marine Corps because we can identify enemy locations. We know what they're looking for because we're looking for it as well. And uh, we're an asset down to the platoon level because we can locate the enemy and know when we are being located as well. So electronic warfare is important to the Marine Corps because in accordance with Force Design 2030, to operate in a more dispersed, desegregated manner, we're going to be relying a lot more heavily on communication structures and unmanned aerial assets. The threat is evolving that the Marine Corps will be facing in the next few years, next couple generations, and the threats we face are able to thrive and uh, they're heavily relying on the electromagnetic spectrum, which is the place we operate. So these services allow small unit leaders to utilize more tools within a toolkit to find the enemy and to feed either the greater situational awareness of that commander, the joint intelligence picture, as well as prosecute any targets on the ground per the commander's guidance.